on a cloudy day. What's up mga kababayan? Kamusta ulit kayo? Ako po ulit si Jaime. Welcome po mga kababayan sa ating vlog. And yun mga kababayan, kung bago ka sa channel ko, ako ay isang OFW dito sa Saudi Alcobar. And gumagawa ako ng mga random lifestyle about Saudi, about OFW. About, about OFW dito sa Saudi mga kababayan. And then, uh, reaction videos about sports and trending topics. So mga kababayan, no? grabe, uh, ang tagal. Tagal ko bago nakapag-upload. Siguro mga halos one week din. So yun mga kabayan, sobrang dami nating pagsubok. Yung mga kabayan talagang nilamon. Nilamon tayo ng problema. So hindi tayo makapag-focus, hindi tayo makapag-concentrate sa paggawa ng content. Kasi madami tayong dapat ayusin, madami tayong problema na dapat hanapan ng solusyon. So napakahirap mga kabayan. So ngayon nga ay sabi ko parang wala na akong nai-offer sa inyo. Parang wala na akong nai-upload. So, nagawa ko to ulit. Gagawa tayo ng reaction videos mga kabayan na about sports. So, eh, may may tayo ngayon mga kabayan na uh, ito, uh, alis, lipat muna tayo kay Easy Mail. Punta muna tayo dito sa 1FC or 1 Championship mga kabayan. No? Dito sa ating kababayan na si Mark Abilardo versus uh, Emilio Urusha. Urusha. So mga kababayan, si Mark Abilardo, napaka ano, napaka tawag nito, uh, underrated. Kasi mga kababayan, sa larangan ng MMA o contact sports or mga mixed martial arts, sa mga kababayan natin Pilipino na lumalaban sa UFC, medyo familiar tayo doon. Mga kababayan natin na lumaban sa Brave, medyo familiar tayo doon. Uh, yung mga kababayan natin na Team Lakay, so familiar din tayo doon, mga, mga lumalaban sa atin doon. And then yung kay Katalan, mga Katalan Brothers, familiar din tayo doon pero ito mga kababayan kay Mark Abilardo, wala akong idea. So may lang makakapanood ng laban niya. And yun, panoorin natin mga kababayan. So tara. And now, representing... Mga pala, kagabi lang na laban to. United States of America! United States. Emilio, the honey badger, Urucha. The game makes martial arts record of 19 wins and 8 losses. Three drink pala to. Fairtex Gym, representing New Zealand Ooh. and the Philippines. Ooh. Introducing Mark Tyson Fairtex Abelardo Solid yung katawan ah Round 1 Let's work one That's the thing Paralit niya Circling to both sides here Emilio Rucha Says he has respect for the Muay Thai game of Abelardo But feels confident Good out suddenly kick again The more power on that one The massive thighs and calves on Mark Abelardo Abelardo said he wants to stay nice and tight, stay inside the pocket. Look at him say go three. That's the hook. The jab one, the cross two, the hook three. Trying to make a point on the lead thigh of Urucia. Mutangkan sa kanyang kalaban, eh, no? Now suddenly kick from Urucia. Just trying to put the position in. Ayo tu mengapa nak slap? Inside the circle to win a match. Nice little uppercut combination landed by Arutia as Abelardo tried to enter the pocket. Yeah, you see all shake it off too, didn't you? Yeah. Those skips forward with a hook uppercut from Arutia on the inside. Active opening round from both men. Again, measuring with the lead hand of Arutia on the front foot uppercut almost took out the ring. So he's saying kickboxing career six and zero. Experience competing all over the world. A lot of me find it hard. Thailand and beyond. Or for a drop down to a double leg damage. That's what he's calling for. Let's see if Ferruccio obliges. Ooh. Hey. Hmm. Grave. Ooh. What's gonna? Ooh. Puta mabot pa Puta mabot pa Puta mabot pa 
wonder how Rook is so stable. Shit. Woo! Round two, put on the level, mga mabahin pala dito. Putting significant combinations of strikes together. If you were to tally who was landing the strikes, there was definitely more strikes and more heavier strikes from Avalardo landing. I'm going to stand from here. Grabe si Iko niya, no? Circle side with myself, Michael Chabot. The Dragon Bitch also has won championship Fist of Fury 2. A double heavyweight main event later on tonight, including the monster. Kapi. I don't think Aruti has fully recovered yet. From uh, him getting rocked, looks a little more gun shy here. That's Urutia. Right hand over the top from Adelardo. Urutia. Whoa, we're getting the double pants, huh? Adelardo throws a short knee. Did he tag him in? Came close to the forehead. Yeah, as he sprawled away, he shot that knee in there. It was a. Arutia's got much better takedowns than that. He can't throw him naked like that. He's got to put the punches together and then shoot in. Urutia's confidence. Has disappeared. It's not just the confidence you watch him as he walks forward here. It's it's as if his legs are still. Grabby, no. I know that was the round one then. Oops, oops. Wow, we're getting double pants, huh? Especially against the guy who could do so much damage, but still had the inside with those elbows. Mark Avalado, as we saw in the opening round, good right hand there from Avalado. Look at the left side of the face of Arutia. Looks like it's been sunburned. Mm. Jab from Arutia. But there's none of that gusto, none of that remember that Emilio had in the opening round. That looks much worse than a sun. Halfway through the contest. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> See, Abelardo's really lived up to the Tyson nickname that he has. Keep his hands tight on the inside. I like his head movement. I like the way that he just. You know, my hitali Abelardo, my old boy. So lead. So lead. That boxing style he's added to his Muay Thai. He get down low. He can spring up and use those gazelle punches. He's so effective, Mark Abelardo. So many striking options for a man undefeated in Muay Thai and kickboxing. Looking good, circle hard. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. He wanted somebody to stand there and trade. Ooh. Last thing, I'll come on up the suit. He's eating two clean punches. I'm in Baba Saul. Nothing. I think Abelardo's making a strategic mistake here because coming out of that, at the end of that first round, coming into the second round, I would have capitalized more with, with you know, having my opponent hurt like that. Ooh. What the body on? Hindi ko nakita pa ano yari yun para sabay sila may tama dun ha. Ayun! Elbow pa rin talaga pala tumama. Yun! Elbow talaga! Parang sakit naman ang ginawa ng referee na yun. Kalsik siya. From Abelardo, the pointer. Man, you came in with that tomahawk elbow and tomahawk elbow pala tawag doon. Just an amazing performance, Mark. Yeah, uh, it was a real tough fight coming into, oh. especially after two losses, you know. Um, it's something I don't ever want to go through again. So I did everything I could in this camp to prevent that. And I'm very happy I came away with the win tonight, especially of a tough guy like Amelia. Yes. Gandun lang tayo makabayan. Galing mag-English, no? <laughs> o nga pala, ang kabayan, yung both parents niya parehas Pinoy, parehas Pilipino, kaso doon na siguro nanirahan sa New Zealand, doon siya pinanganak. Kaya ang galing niya mag-English. Pero kita naman sa si itsura, Pilipino-Pilipino. So yun, mga kabayan, no, sa akin, underrated. Kasi ngayon ko palang napanood yung laban niya, eh. Galing nung elbow, no? Uh, matapang din. Malakas kaya din tumanggap ng suntok. Dami niya inabot dito, eh. Pero kaya. Galing. Congrats, congrats kabayan, nagaling mo. Tapos yun mga kabayan, no, uh, may bago tayong aabangan sa nakita natin nito sa Pilipino na to, na naglalaro ng MMA. 
Eh, bago tayong bukod dun sa mga team lakay natin or bukod kila Brandon Vera, bukod dun sa Catalan Brothers, may bago tayo ngayon. Ito nga si Mark Abelardo. So, ang galing. So, yun lang mga babae na i-share ko lang kasi nakakatuwa eh. Ah, ako, sa, honestly, ngayon ko lang napanood yung laban nito ni Mark Abelardo. So, yun lang. Maraming maraming salamat. Ulit mga kababayan, please support my channel po. Kung bago ka sa channel ko, ako po ulit ay isang OFW na, na, na nandito sa Alcobar, Saudi Arabia. At gumagawa po ako ng random lifestyle about OFW dito sa Saudi. And reaction videos about sports and trending topics. So yun mga kapabayan, maraming maraming salamat. Mga kapatid, sa mga kapatid ko dyan sa Pilipinas, Masikampo Family and Dondoyano Family, eh, maraming maraming salamat. Pray lang natin, kaya natin yan. Alam ko naman eh, lahat naman talaga na, lahat naman ngayon, maraming pinagdadaanan na problema, pero tayo din eh, sinusubok ngayon ng panahon. Grabe si 2020. Hindi pa siya natapos hanggang 2021. Nagmimigay pa rin ng mga problema sa tao. Pero pray lang, kaya kaya natin yan. Maraming maraming salamat sa inyo sa pagsuport sa channel ko. And mga babayan, 3,430 na tayo mga babayan. Kunti na lang, 3,500 na tayo. So yun mga babayan, no? kaya ba natin ng 5,000 itong year na to? So yun, maraming maraming salamat po. God bless po sa ating lahat. God bless po sa mga mag-anak natin sa Pilipinas. God, God bless po sa lahat ng YFW sa buong mundo. See you my next vlog. Bye!